If I had known these things before I started <laughs> trying to lose weight, oh, I would have saved years, literally years of trying to lose weight. Um, you guys know that I tried lots of approaches and I didn't lose weight for a really long time. Hey guys, it's Liesl Jane. Today I really just wanted to give you a video where I just talk about the three, that's five, <laughs> the three biggest things that I wish that I'd known before I started my weight loss journey. It was a long journey. You guys know it was a long journey. Woo. Hopefully if you're getting started on your weight loss journey, these can help you and they can just give you a little bit of a head start so you don't have to go through what I went through. <laughs> The first thing that I wish that I had known before I started my weight loss journey was that calories matter. But before you think you have to count every single calorie, you don't have to count every single calorie. Now, how does that work? It took me years to realize that I actually needed to take calories into consideration. I was like, mm -mm, I ain't counting calories for a really long time. And then when I finally realized that I needed to take, I finally tried it after years and I started to lose weight really quickly. I was like, okay, I need to, be mindful of my calories but then i felt like i was going crazy because i had i was been i'd been counting every single calorie and i was like <laughs> that's terrible so i just want to say you don't have to count count every single calorie i have a much simpler way of doing this i actually came up with this thing that i call the point system these are jane's point system <laughs> i made a whole video about it recently so i will link that video below if you guys haven't seen it go check it out i it's basically just like rounding off your calories and i just realized that a rough estimation is all you need so if i was like gonna eat 1400 calories a day or 1600 calories a day or 1200 calories a day all i had to do was eat roughly that and not exactly that i needed to be mindful of calories they matter <laughs> when you're trying to lose weight but i didn't need to count every single calorie every single calorie because that's awful i'll link that video below go check it out <sighs> save my life the second thing that I wish that I'd known before I started my weight loss journey was that I needed to be eating a little bit more protein. Okay. Yeah. I never thought that I would say that. Over my weight loss journey, I have realized that you need to be eating all of the main food groups, healthy carbs, healthy whole carbs, healthy fats, and good protein. But I've just come to realize that I do need to be eating a little bit more protein balancing it all out but just make, making sure i'm getting enough protein so the, basically they say as a guideline that women should be eating 0.8 grams of protein for every kilogram on their body of their body weight if you take like kilograms or pounds and then i'll put the conversions for pounds and all that on the screen if you can figure out 0.8 grams of protein for every kilogram on your body and you just try to make sure that you're getting roughly that amount of protein at least with your whole carbs and your healthy fats because those are really important as well. I'm not saying don't eat carbs, eat carbs, eat healthy fats, a balanced diet, but making sure that you're getting enough protein for your body size and your body weight. Wish that I'd known that before I started my weight loss journey, but now I know anyway, so I can tell you guys. You don't wanna lose muscle while you are losing fat. <laughs> you don't really want to be doing that. You kind of want to keep your muscles so you want to eat enough protein to make sure that you're keeping some lean muscle on your body. That doesn't mean you have to be bulky, but it's just going to be healthier. You're going to be less likely to lose muscle and you're going to be more likely to lose fat. The third and final thing that I wish that I'd known before I started my weight loss journey is that it's not just about exercising. You kind of want to be doing the right kind of exercising to lose weight. After trying a lot of different exercise approaches and spending a lot of hours in the gym and on the road running and just doing a lot of cardio and endurance training, I and after doing a lot of research, I found that doing high intensity interval training and strength training was the best thing for me to get the results that I wanted. And a lot of people, there's a lot of people who find the same thing. So basically high intensity interval training, HIT, as you may know it, H-I-T-T, no H-I-I-T, great for burning fat and boosting the metabolism and just like, you know, doing a good workout in a short amount of time. I will link my 16 minute HIT worker workout below. I did a video on that and that is my go-to workout. That is probably ugh, my favorite workout ever. And I've been doing it for years and it helped me so much. And then the other thing is strength training. So important as well. It goes great with the protein thing. And if you want to um, 
build a little bit of lean muscle not to be bulky but just have a little be toned and fine and it's so good for you it's so good to just be strong you know you don't have to be bulky but just be strong and do a bit of strength training get toned get firm that's gonna help you with the strength training i will link my fitness routine that i used to lose weight below so you guys can go check that out but yeah that's really what helped me doing the right kind of exercise not spending hours in the gym wasting your time and not seeing results like i did for a long time just you know doing some hit doing some strength training so that is it those are the three things that i really wish that someone had told me oh, i'm sure people did try to tell me but i i was too busy focused on doing fad diets and things that didn't help me i will link all of those videos that i talked about below i do want to just want to say bonus bonus tip for you guys that it wasn't included in these top three things it's an obvious one so i didn't include it but drink lots of water <laughs> trust me on that everyone says it but just do it drink lots of water drink at least eight to ten glasses of water a day i highly recommend it i will also link a video below where i explain to you guys how you can figure out how many calories you need in a day to lose weight yeah anyway i really hope that you enjoyed this video and i hope that it can be helpful to you to if you're just getting started with losing weight or if you've struggled to lose weight if you can just take these three things plus the water thing bonus tip and just sort of start to do those things um i think that it can help you a lot everyone's different so you need to find what works for you but i really hope that that can be helpful to you give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and subscribe to my channel for more videos and i'll see you guys again very soon <laughs>